All right, you guys, for homework tonight, I want you each to pick your favorite literary character. And then on Thursday, hold up, here's the fun part. We'll all come to class dressed as those characters and give a presentation! Why, why is that going to be fun? Because you guys look goofy. <laughs> <laughs> You there, put that fire extinguisher down. All right, fine. Put out the fire first. <laughs> Mr. Frino, bed sheets are not part of the dress code unless you have a religious exemption, like that math teacher with no vowels in his name. Oh, wait till next week. I'll be wearing a snappy new slipcover that's so me. <laughs> Actually, sheet boy, Starting next week, you can wear whatever you like because you won't be working here anymore. Come on, Mr. Fuss. You're just the dean of discipline. You can't fire me. You could spank me, but I'd expect dinner first. <laughs> <It's funny. coughs> now, do you remember that emergency substitute license that got you this job? It's only good for 30 days. It expires at the end of the week. You're kidding. How come nobody told me? I wanted to be the very first. <laughs> so that's it, man. Friday, I'm gone. Audi 5. I feel bad. You know, I brought you in here, and you were really starting to connect with the kids. It's really sad knowing I'm only going to be a teacher for another three days. No, sad is knowing you're going to be a teacher for another seven years, ten months, four days, and, uh, 37 minutes. <laughs> There's got to be a way to extend a substitute's license. You take some stupid night school course in classroom management. Oh, how do you know that? A certain drunken sailor took that course 23 years, 11 months, and three days ago. <laughs> Nick, that's great. All you got to do is go back to school and take a course. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. I don't want to go back to school. Had it with education. I'm a teacher now. <laughs> oh, come on, man. It's not school you're afraid of. It's commitment. What? That is so off. I, I have committed to a lot of things. Yeah, staying single, changing apartments, not being able to hold a job. Hey, man, I'm following a dream. <laughs> well, wake up. Because you're finally doing something with your life that means something. And you're good at it. Well, you know what? I'm good at other things. Obviously, you have forgotten about my acting career. Me and the rest of show business. <laughs> Look, man, I just don't know if I want to go through the rest of my life breathing chalk dust. <laughs> Come on, man, take the course. For once in your life, make a commitment. I don't know. Look, it's not forever. You can at least finish out the rest of the year. Dad, maybe you're right. I mean, the kids are great. I feel good about what I'm doing. Another year is not going to kill me. <laughs> Okay, I'm looking over your choices of great literary characters, and to use an educational term, they really bite. <laughs> Come on, you guys. Gilligan? Scooby-Doo? Oh, the fat nun from Sister Act? Come on, Mr. Frito, why are you being so picky? Orlando, do you really feel that you chose great literary characters? Maybe not Butthead, but Beavis is deep. <laughs> no! Butthead is the deep one! <laughs> Look, the point is, you've got to choose a character that's not from TV or movies. Now, only one person in this class did that. Not me. Please, not me. I'm not going to mention any names. Thank you. Okay, it was Sarah. <laughs> who chose Desdemona from Shakespeare's Othello. Brainiac, don't you watch TV? No TV on planet Brainiac. <laughs> All right, you guys knock it off. Yeah, it's not her fault her family doesn't own a TV. <gasps> Orlando, don't help. <laughs> no TV? What do you do at dinner? <laughs> we talk? About what? I don't know, stuff, books we've read, 
Can I go to the nurse? <laughs> you guys, books, they, they just have it all over television. I mean, look, Ivanhoe. It's, it's filled with romance. What's up, girl? Mm. <laughs> Battle scenes with people getting swords rammed through their guts. Uh, uh. You talking about my mama fool? Come on. <laughs> Shake. It's all that good stuff they won't let kids watch on TV anymore. Hey, and here's the best part. No commercials. So if you have to go to the bathroom, you can take the book with you. <laughs> all right, I want you guys to choose new characters for your presentation with one rule. From books, no TV. Hey, Sarah, I'm sorry to put you on the spot like that. I know that brainiac stuff can hurt. I remember what it was like to be the smartest kid in the class. You were the smartest kid? Well, no, but I, I sat right next to him. Nice try, Mr. Freno. course is taught to teachers by a teacher who wants you to succeed. You're right. It's time for a little commitment in my life. No, no, no. You're going in. You're the teacher that wants me to succeed? <laughs> no. When you look this close, you want to see dramatically magnified lashes, not clumps or globs. Look to CoverGirl Professional Advanced Mascara. The unique ProGlide system separates and defines without the usual clumps or globs. Guaranteed. Try it. If you don't agree, just call 1-888-CoverGirl for refund details. Professional Advanced Mascara. Dramatically magnified lashes without the usual clumps or globs. Guaranteed. Only by CoverGirl. You want to have a blast on New Year's Eve? We're messing with the world order of time. So you can ring in the new year early on the second annual WB New Year's Eve Jam. We're going to do, do a lot of parties. Double bus, Ruby! Yeah. We're doing the coast to coast celebration. Two full hours of your favorite WB stars and new episodes of Wayne Head and Road Rovers. And we'll smash into the new year by dropping that anvil on the WB water tower. So ring in the new year early, Tuesday on the WB New Year's Eve Jam. It's the Payless Clearance Sale, and our shoes are doing a little disappearing act. Dress, casuals, athletics, you'll find lots of styles on sale now for five, seven, and nine dollars. But hurry, because while you sit there and wait, our good stuff is quickly vanishing. Hey, Mom, isn't it about time to change that Glade plug-ins refill? Refill your Glade plug-ins every 45 days to keep your home Glade fresh. Plug it in, plug it in. Sunday on a special 7th Heaven, when you're young and in love. Don't you dare tackle me. I was going to tackle you. I was going to kiss you. You think you know everything. He's been out with lots of girls, and he's more experienced than me. Oh. 7th Heaven, Sunday on a special day and time. The city of Chicago. My name's Friday. I'm a cop. Bill and I came home from work. Nothing to eat but a frozen duck. Boy, you know it's going to take all day to thaw that iceberg out. We went to service merchandise for guaranteed low prices. So you need a microwave and dinnerware? Yes, ma'am. At service merchandise, we found a huge selection of quality name brands for the kitchen. Falls Graft dinnerware, Circulon cookware, Krupp's coffee makers, a complete selection of brawn. The list goes on. And those are the facts. When I started losing my hair, it bothered me, and I finally got to the point where I just didn't want to think about it anymore. But I didn't want to do anything until I knew I could get the look that I wanted. The most important thing to me was the hairline. It had to look natural. Hair Club for Men is proud to announce a technological breakthrough. Call our toll-free number now to receive your free copy of Hair Club's exciting new technology brochure. I just love the idea that I can get out of the shower, towel dry my hair, blow dry it, and I'm gone. So call now and get Hair Club's new technology brochure. You'll see before and after photos of men like yourself who have already experienced the benefits of this innovative technology. I'd seen too many people that had tried surgery or products that promised to grow their hair back again. I wanted something that was simple, non-surgical, that would give me the results that I was really after. Call 
our toll-free number for your free brochure. Because Hair Club for Men really can make a difference. You've already missed two weeks. You've got some serious catching up to do. Read these by tomorrow. <laughs> All these? Oh, oh yes, I can see how that could be a little overwhelming. At least you gave it a shot. Good night. Don't forget to buckle up. <laughs> Actually, I'm thirsty for knowledge. I think I'll take these home, put them... It's destructive. 